In the electrification of vehicles, we have a strong tendency towards autonomous driving and advanced driver assistance systems, or ADAS. This leads to applications like steer by wire or electric traction inverters, which typically rely on accurate feedback of angular position and velocity in harsh environments. For such applications, resolvers, like uh, this one here, are commonly used. Now, interfacing with such resolvers can be tricky because they require sine waves with high currents around 100 milliamps coming from supplies of 12 or 24 volts. Our most recent dual operational amplifier, the TSB5A2, can offer exactly this. With supply voltages ranging from 4 to 36 volts, it is capable to deliver an output current of 2 times 200 milliamps and offers all the necessary better protection against short circuits and over temperature. So probably you're wondering about the demo here behind me. We are showing here how a TSB582 power op amp enables a microcontroller to interface to a resolver and read out its angular position. The screen shows the excitation sine wave driving the resolver as well as the two return waveforms coming back from the resolver. Now these two change in amplitude depending on the steering wheel's position. And this is what you can see when rotating the steering wheel either to the left or to the right. The return signals are treated by one of our ST low noise automotive op amps. And the microcontroller takes the ratio between the two signals to calculate to the angular position. I have to say that here at the Embedded World, we are enjoying having our visitors come and try out the smoothness of the system on a character racing game. For more information about the TSB582, as well as our op amp portfolio and free samples, please visit us on st.com or contact your local ST representative.